I beg your pardon? Got it. Now I get it. <clears throat> Excuse me, how rude. Um, just so everyone's aware, the National Weather Service has issued a tornado watch for counties to the west of us, not for us. Uh, two years ago, two Augusts ago, right off this back porch, I videotaped a tornado that was three quarters of a mile away from our house, headed that way. That was cool. It did cause some destruction in a town near here called Stoughton, and uh, one person actually did die. Ironically, they, it was a husband and wife on their way down to their basement, and their chimney, I know, that's what my wife said too, while I was videotaping it, on the porch outside, watching the tornado three quarters of a mile away. Um, it was, I'll get the video up here and I'll post it on, on my site so people can see it. Um, well, exactly, right. So they're on their way to the basement, and their chimney got blown over, and it fell onto the guy's head, and he died instantly. Um, but we don't have a chimney. I mean, we do, but it's not brick, and it's not going to hurt me if it falls. It's metal. Now, if it gets sliced and, you know, cuts through my body, that would be bad. Yeah snowstorms. We had, we had a shit winter. We had a horrible winter. We had so much snow this winter. We had over 100 inches of snow in Madison. Yeah, he's up in uh, Boston. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so stupid. She sorry about that. All right, what is your association? Um, White Spire, are you still in here? Yeah. Buffalo, Buffalo, pff, I'm being attacked by a beetle. Land on the camera. That'd be awesome. It's one of those Japanese beetles that everyone calls ladybugs because they are. Holy shit. What do you ride a bike? What school, by the way? Are we talking college? Where do you go? Is it pronounced Worcester? Worcester. Go park the car over by Worcester. Yeah, so how many people call it Worcester when you write it out? Like all of them? Alright, so what's your major? Please say English. Please say English. Professor, I have a whole system of errors. Hi. 
how does one fall into sociology? That's what college is for. That's cool. Hey, do you need a pizza stone? Oh, nice. That's cool. Hey, now, wait a minute. Are you saying that eating frozen pizza is not okay? I was just saying, we eat it all the time. Super easy, and it's delicious. All right, so I want to do an audio test, because the Snowball mic has three different audio settings, and I want to know which one makes a difference. That is awesome. A piano? Like an uh, an upright piano you're talking? Not a <laughs> not a baby grand. I don't think it would fit in an elevator. Would you play shit and stuff? <laughs> if neither of you knew how to play the piano, what what made you decide to do the piano? Nice. <laughs> that is an awesome experiment. Um, okay, so I'm going to switch this over to another audio setting, and we're going to see whether it sounds better to you guys or not better. So this is the other one. So say, write something that I'll speak about so that you can hear me talk. Yes, the quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. Can you tell a difference from when it was, what it was up until now and what this sounds like? Because I think it, the difference is that the first one that I was using was omni, was uh, unidirectional, just picking out what's in front of the mic, and this one is omnidirectional, I think. I'm not sure. I have to read the manual. I don't usually read the manual. This sounds better. Is it louder, or is it just clearer, or... Hmm. Can you hear the background noise? Because I have the TV up now. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm sorry. I'm gonna. I'm probably gonna side with the girl on this one. All right. So there's a third setting. Let me try the third setting, and we'll see if this is like the suckiest, or maybe it's a good average. All right, so this is the other one. This is the third one, and I've turned, I've, I've muted the TV, so it's just me talking and maybe some traffic noise, but not much. So can you tell the difference on this audio? It sounds, just sounds softer, like quieter. And it's already kind of quiet to begin with, right? Really? Okay, so this one is the loudest. And again, I have no background sound right now. It's just me blathering on about my puny little life. The quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. Blah, blah, blah.